So one of the questions that I've been getting related to community college has been, how much did I pay to attend my community college? During my two years at a California community college, how much money did I pay to the school in order to attend? That's a pretty reasonable question, so I decided to break it down for you guys. So to be completely honest, I've been out of college for you know a couple years now and community college was several years ago. Not several years ago, but you know, like three plus years ago. So I forget the exact uh, numerical, you know, sum of how much I paid, but I'll give you a general sense of how much I paid to go to community college. So after doing a quick research online, I typed in Las Positas College, which was the community college that I attended, and then I put in tuition. It tells me that the in-state tuition is $1,134. So in-state, and then it says for out-of-state students, so let's say you know someone's from New York and they want to attend a community college in California, it's $7,000. 734. So let's just average this to 1.2K and then let's just average this to 7.8K. Obviously, if I round it, um, it should be lower, but it's always good to be safe. So if you're from California and you want to attend the community college, you're looking at a roughly, you know, let's say $1,200 per year. And actually on the website, on my community college website, it says that for California residents, it's $46 per unit. $46 per unit. For those of you guys who aren't too familiar with the tuition prices and how much it costs to attend college, bro, $46 per unit is extremely cheap. You know, back then when my parents went to college, I think they told me it was like 46 per class. So, you know, if a class is three, four units, it was probably $10 per unit. But, you know, we're not living in the 70s. We're not living in the 80s. We're living in 2020 so you got to keep that in mind so obviously i'm not going to do the math for you if you're taking 15 units just multiply this by 15. actually let's see what it is let's just see how much it is i'm kind of curious 46 times 15. if i multiply this by 15 units let's say what i take a semester this is 690 dollars every semester you're paying about 700 and you times that by two because two semesters in a year and that roughly averages to 1.2 you know it'll be a little bit more 1.4 but still regardless dude less than two thousand dollars a year to attend community college that is extremely cheap compare this to my school tuition where i graduated from usc every year the average tuition is about roughly 75k seventy five thousand dollars you're paying to attend college. If you guys think 1,200 is expensive, bro, look at this. This is not even a comparable sum. It's not even comparable at all. Luckily for me, I didn't pay the 1.2 or you know, the 1.5 or whatever. For me at community college, I actually had financial aid. Yes, you can apply for financial aid even in community college as well as a traditional four-year university. I forget the exact number I paid, but I basically went to community college for free. I remember that the tuition was so low that I just paid it myself. You know, sometimes in college, you know, your parents may help you out, but the number I had to pay was so small, I just paid it monthly by myself. The only thing that I had to pay for community college were textbooks and textbooks are pretty expensive you know they're you know 60 100 depending on the topic and depending on the professor i'd say to be safe every semester i paid maybe 200 maybe 300 so obviously you know this number is not gonna relate to every single community college in america it's not gonna reflect accurately maybe you the person who's watching this but the general idea the general concept that i want you to understand is community college is very cheap it's very affordable it's designed to be easy and affordable so that anybody can go and transfer out to a top 25. obviously the 
transferring is not a guaranteed process, but the chances of you transferring well is high if you are consistent and persistent with your studies. So at the end of the day, if there's one thing I want you to take from this video is, dude, community college is easy, you save a lot of money, the classes are easier, the curriculum is easier, so the overall chances of you transferring successfully is much higher. If you guys are debating if you should go to community college or not, hey man, look at the stats, dude. This is just facts. This is data. Data is not false, you know? So make the decision, make the wise decision, and hopefully you guys transfer well as well.